We've also expedited our M1 Abrams timelines to supply Ukraine with more armored capability in the coming months. And the M1s that the Ukrainians will use for training will arrive here in Germany in the next few weeks. And all of this is huge progress. And I am confident that this equipment and the training that accompanied it, it will put Ukraine's forces in a position to continue to succeed on the battlefield. Biased, but I think the M1 tank is the best tank in the world. Uh, there are other tanks that are quite good. Leopards, for example, are being provided as well. But I do think the M1 tank, when it is uh, uh, delivered, uh, will make a difference. So there is no silver bullet in this case, but I do think the M1 tank, when it's delivered and it reaches its operational capability, that it will be very effective on the battlefield. deployed some forces uh, to into uh, uh, theater to ensure that uh, we uh, provide as many options as possible if we are called on to do something and we haven't been called on to do uh, anything yet. No decision uh, on anything has been made. Uh, and for operation security purposes, as you would guess, I, I, I won't specify, you know, where those troops uh, uh, move to and, uh, and but, uh, but our focus is to make sure that we continue to do prudent planning and that we create uh, and maintain as many options for uh, our president as possible.